Helping you and your family live healthy. Obesity affects one in five children here in the U.S. and it can lead to severe health problems later in life. News for Jack's anchor Jennifer Waugh shows us the contributing factors and what you can do while your child is still young to give them their healthiest future. To understand obesity, you first need to know how it's diagnosed. A pediatrician breaks it down for us as we recognize National Childhood Obesity Month. Pediatricians calculate this after they measure a child's height and weight. Uh, it's, it accounts for the fact that a taller child will weigh uh, more naturally just by virtue of being bigger. And it turns out that body mass index is a fair indicator of total body fat tissue. Dr. Roy Kim with Cleveland Clinic says obesity rates have continued to rise during the last few decades. Contributing factors may be due to lifestyle, environment, and genetics. He says it's important to get the health condition under control before it leads to long-term issues. For example, a child could go on to develop high blood pressure, high cholesterol, or type 2 diabetes. There are also some psychological concerns. Dr. Kim says a child could become depressed, socially isolated, or even face bullying or body shaming. When it comes to treatment, new guidelines were released just earlier this year. What's interesting about the new guidelines is that still at the foundation uh, are therapeutic lifestyle changes, mainly uh, nutrition counseling and an increase in physical activity. We know these are effective and 100% safe. So the guidelines also suggest offering certain weight loss medications and even surgery when medically necessary. To learn more, it is best to consult with your child's pediatrician. Jennifer Waugh, Channel 4, The Local Station.